YouTube, what is up? Welcome back to the channel, guys. Today we're checking out South Park. I think it's I think it's pronounced tst, I don't know T S S T, which is probably tst, but I don't know, man. Y'all let me know in the comments. But listen, if you want to take your support to the next level and get access to full episode reactions, the link to my Patreon is in the description below. But before we go any further. I need you to do me a solid. If you could drop a like and a comment on this video for the algorithm, I would greatly appreciate it. But uh, y'all ready for this one? Let's run it, baby. Let's get it. Let's go. Mrs. Cartman, we have had it with your son's behavior, okay? Little Billy Turner is now being treated at the hospital. Eric, why would you do something? What happened? Thing? I'm sorry I handcuffed Billy Turner's ankle to the school flagpole. You know that's not the What? Point. That's very Yo, what kind of saw What kind of saw shit is that, bro? Wow. Yo, Carmen is a demon, bro. He's a menace. I know. I know he's out of control, but you don't know what it's like. <laughs> <laughs> he terrorizes oh, her too. Sorry. It's just that he seems to get worse every day. <laughs> he just never listens. <laughs> bro, why why am I starting to feel bad for her, bro? I shouldn't be feeling bad for her crying and, and complaining about about Cartman, but for some reason, for some reason I'm like low key like, hey man, it, it, it's gonna be okay. We're gonna find a solution. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I'm actually in the room with them. Well, nice going, asshole. You made my mom cry. It's not him. It's you, ah. I don't know what to do with you. They're every parent's worst nightmare. Shut up, I hate you, I hate you. Oh, my God. completely out of control. Look, I'm skating, I'm skating. It's time to call Nanny 911. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Tonight. Mom, I need another energy drink. Oh my this god. Son of a single parent just won't behave. And then What episode is that? What episode is that when he goes full blown German? Let me know in the comments, bro, because I've seen that in the compilation video, but I don't know what episode it is. I appreciate it. Thank you. Stella is selected to set him straight. It's time for Nanny Stella to show Eric Cartman his ways are not going to be tolerated anymore. Her teeth about yellow as that wall. Mom, are you deaf? Somebody's at the door. Yes, I think it's the nanny, Poopsikins. Killer, I'm going to be on TV now. <laughs> Hello, I'm Nanny Stella. Oh, thank you so much for coming. Please come in. First of all, no video games until chores are done. <laughs> oh, Let's go down the video game and go to the kitchen. No, thanks. I'd rather not. Oh right, my god, he's mocking her. Take it. Oh Eric, my no, god. This is not acceptable. Stop trying to bogart my Xbox, you fat. Oh, right, that's it. You're going to time out. Time out? And what exactly keeps me on the stool? It's the time out stool. You can't get down until the time is up. You better get down. <laughs> How did I do that? <laughs> Alright, seriously, you're starting to piss me off now. Eric, you need to listen. Hold on. Why is she lifting him up like with ease? Like, it's not a problem, bro. She is strong as hell. That kid weighs at least a buck fifty. Easy, bro. Easy. To me, this is very important. I'm getting down to eye level with Eric so that I can talk to him on his level. Good job, Uncle. Oh! He spit in my mouth. You see the, 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 the block with the knives in it on the counter? Yo, that would have been straight. Back to the dome, bro. What? My man spit in her mouth, bro. Like, flam eye and everything, dog. Hell no. Well, I'm feeling confused because I don't understand why you became a nanny. <laughs> Me? <laughs> well, because I love children like you. Right, but if you love children so much, how come you're not a mommy? Oh, I just never had kids. Why not? The truth is, nobody ever wanted to have babies with you. Isn't that it? Oh, my God. Always the mom's maid, never the mom. Oh, Most my God. You. The years are ticking away. <laughs> your friends all getting married, and all the while, your uterus slowly shriveling away. Holy drying up, shit. Becoming totally worthless. Why, you... You... You little bastard! How dare you! Kick him. Eric Naughty. What kind of monster? 
Mr. Wolf! Yes, let the anger come! Strike me down while you can! That's it! I'm not doing this! Oh, but we really need some help! Find yourself another nanny! Television show! Yo, she rage quit. <laughs> <laughs> she sucks, bro. L nanny. Holy crap. She let homie just like disrespect the crap out of her, bro. Homie was on demon time. Cartman was not playing. Mom didn't do nothing. The nanny ain't do anything. Damn. All right. So I think this is another show. Let's see how it goes with them. This child's behavior is totally unacceptable. Totally. But there's no child too tough for Super Nanny. In just three days' time, you're going to see a new Eric Cartman. Mm. Three days later. Mental I'm hospital? Super Nanny is in a deep state of mental psychosis. Ew. <laughs> Yo, what did Cartman her. do to her? It's from her! <laughs> When good dogs go bad, there's one man who's their best friend, <laughs> Caesar Milan. No dog is too much for me to handle. I rehabilitate I see dogs. This guy. I train people. The zoo gets bit by dogs all the time, but then like by the end of the interaction, the dog is like under control, not bugging out, not biting people, not jumping on people. I am the dog whisperer. The dog whisperer. You can stop talking behind my back. I'm right here, fruitcake. <laughs> See, I'm not looking at the child. I'm not acknowledging the child. I'm just letting the child know I'm not interested in him. Not interested in me. See, the child thinks your world revolves around him because it does. Because everything he does gets a response from you. Yeah, well, I don't see why. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Look at his face, bro. Look at Carmen's face right now. Yo, he's literally, he's literally doing like, um... Like, the way he's treating Cartman is the same exact way he would treat a dog. You know what I'm saying? This is probably going to work. Emmy, let, let him know we are having a conversation. Man, this guy does it. Ah, quit it. What is that you're doing? <laughs> Dogs show their dominance by nipping each other on the neck, but it works equally well in the child. I think the first thing we need to work on is getting the child some exercise. He's fat and he has all this pent-up energy that we need to let him burn off. Do you take walks with your son? Well, no, I don't. Go on, take your son for a walk. Damn it. <laughs> Don't look at him. Just look straight Yo, ahead. I'm loving this, him. bro. Poke him harder. Oh, damn it. Where he tired him out. Here, why don't you try it now? Take your son. Hey, I'm good stuff, Caesar. Me. Good. Just keep your confidence. Shoulders back. Eyes straight ahead. The child can pick up on that confidence learning he's supposed to follow you, not lead you. Mom, don't you love me? Can't you see I'm unhappy right now? <laughs> Man! Good, Miss Carmen. Very good. <laughs> what I've done is I've brought over some Kentucky Fried Chicken. Ooh, Colonel. Uh-oh. I am going to eat first. That's going to work. That is what the pack leader does. Give, give me the chicken. G give me some chicken. <laughs> Mom, give me, give me some chicken. I want some chicken, Mom. We won't reward him until he's in a calm, submissive behavior. God damn it, I am not a dog! <laughs> look at him, look at him! Suck my asshole, Taco Bender! <laughs> See? God damn it, you can't stand here and eat KFC in front of me! Now hand it over! You can't do that to me! God damn it, you didn't get him! Oh my god! That's exactly what he does to the dog! I'm not being aggressive, I'm being dominant. Hey guys, I've got some pretty big news. I ran away from home. Yeah, my mom just doesn't care about me anymore, so I moved out. You're not staying at my house either. <laughs> All right, that's fine. But I'll crash with you. No, my parents won't let me bring homeless people home anymore. Oh my God! Well, anymore? Expect me to do? Stay at Kenny's house? His family's totally poor. I'm not staying with poor people. All right, I'll stay with Kenny. Let's go, man. Cool, cool. I'll just go sleep on the street somewhere, out in the cold. Probably get mugged and gang raped by some minorities. <laughs> This is an idiot. I mean, first of all, he's the one that decided to run away without having a plan in place, bro. Like, this is a this is a a life altering decision. You know what I'm saying? At least touch base with people to see who can help you out, who can't. You know what I'm saying? Before you go and do something as crazy as running away. You feel me? So you that that's on you, bro. That's your fault, bro. He's really. <laughs> Nah, bruh. You going home. 
Yup, yup. All right, I'm back. Oh, Eric, I'm so happy you're home. Yes, well, hopefully you've learned your lesson. I've come back, but there's going to be some changes around here. Who's Look crazy? what I did, Eric. I learned how to make Sumie paintings. I'd almost forgotten how artistic I was. That's super interesting, but I've been out living on the streets for almost four hours. Make me something to eat. Caesar. Four hours, bro? My man was out for only four hours? That's like a trip to the mall as a kid. Like, that's nothing. I am your son, and you will listen to me. You have no right to... <laughs> Mom, knock it off. I'm not going to stand for... <laughs> Why are you doing this? Smash. Hell yeah. I did it. Look, Carmen is so fat that when he's laying on his back, his feet don't even touch the ground. Like, his legs are still in the air, bro. He's like a turtle. You see, you are calm, assertive, and in control. Damn. Oh, he's oh like a gosh. dog, bro. See, this is the behavior we've been looking for. This is a relaxed, submissive state. He's never done this before. Good, now you can reward the behavior with praise and attention. I love you very much, Poopsikins. Your mommy's sunshine. Now you can give him a snack. <laughs> good, this is really good. Now try a command. Eric, I want you to go upstairs and brush your teeth. Then I'll be up to read you a story before bed. All right, now here's the plan. At 9.45 tonight, I will sneak out of my room and leave the house, leaving the back door unlocked. You guys come into the house at 10.30 p.m. sharp. Having given me enough time to get down to Perkins and be seen by everyone there. And then all Bro, they didn't give you a place to crash when you ran away. You think they're gonna they're gonna help you with this ridiculous plan, bro? Oh, well how about I just do everything? How does that sound? I just do everything while you guys sit here and play video games. Go for it. It's your plan. Right, I'll do it by myself. You forced me to do this. You couldn't just love me as a son. You just had to humiliate and degrade me with your ruse. I won't let you dominate my life anymore. Goodbye, mother. Don't do it, bro. Is she gonna wake up? I can do whatever I want with her. It's more important <laughs> I live the way I want. What the hell? She isn't an object you can own. She's a human being. She isn't an object I can own. She's a human being. Who was that? Yeah, I'm making stuff up. <laughs> okay, so that's that's like an internal good versus evil battle, right? Like that's what's going on. Maybe all these changes are good for me. Maybe the world doesn't revolve around me. Maybe the world doesn't revolve around me. Facts. It doesn't. <laughs> what the hell? The doesn't revolve around me. <laughs> what is happening right now? I'm going to need y'all to give me some info in the comments below, bro. I don't know what the hell is happening right now. Why did he throw up all that all that black juice, that that black slime, black liquid, that venom, whatever that was, right? And why was he glitching in the hallway? I don't I don't get it. Oh, Eric, I'm very proud of you. Did it work? Is he is he is he straight now? I love you, sweetie. Okay, mom, you're embarrassing me. Jeez. Caesar, I'm so happy you're back. How is the child doing? Oh, he's amazing. I think the change in personality happened. He's doing things for himself now, and he seems to be accepting it. I've lost a best friend, but I've gained a son. And to show my gratitude, I've got two tickets for you and me to see Madam Butterfly this Friday night. Well, no, my work is done. I've got to get back to Los Angeles. Oh, oh damn. But I thought we were becoming friends. No, not really. You're just a client. <laughs> well, good luck to you. Gotta go. Yeah, she's lonely, bro. I cleared up the table, Mom. I'm gonna go upstairs and make my bed now. Eric, how would you like to go with me to see Madam Butterfly Friday night? No, that's okay. Besides, I told Stan and Kyle we could work on our science project then. Well, what if I took you to Kentucky Fried Chicken afterward? And then we'll go to Target and I'll buy you a Mega Ranger? Could I Is she about to ruin him again? Two Mega Rangers? Yes, darling. You can have whatever you want. All that worked for nothing. Oh my god, bro. She had it in the bag. 
Everything was straight. She's a lonely woman, bro. She needs friends. She needs company. You know what I'm saying? And 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 I guess that's why she has that kind of relationship with Cartman. But anyways, dope episode. Sound off in the comments below. Let me know what is next from South Park. And I get to that ASAP. Listen, I appreciate you pulling up and watching this video with me. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button if you haven't yet. And join the family. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.